Hi everyone, John Osipinski here. Most people don't understand the role of the lymphatic system, meaning that it's a system that's meant to clean us. Most of them just know the words. The lymphatic system is something that everybody really needs to understand because it's a system that cleans our skin, our muscles, our bones, our organs, our nerves, our brain, and we ignore it. So I'm developing a virtual course and I'm almost done. I've been working on it a while and it will be life changing. My first class is going to be a class for everybody because everybody needs to understand the lymphatic system. I'd like to show you one of the best ways to improve your lymphatic system. You've heard of rebounding, you've heard of taking a cold and warm, a hot and warm shower, hot and cold shower, you've heard of uh, many different things, magnetic tables. Uh, it really is important that we know that our hands are the most important tool that we have in helping to move the lymphatic system. This tiny network of vessels and nodes can be stretched, can be pumped, and we immediately move waste out of the body. I'm not saying that we're hoping that we move waste. When you drain your lymphatic system, when you self-drain your lymphatic system, you're immediately improving circulation and natural detoxification. You feel more alive after you drain yourself. So please stop by OsipinskiHealthAcademy.com and check out my classes that are coming up because they will really change your life. Right now, I want to show you how to open up your major lymph drain. Remember, you always hear me talk about this, that there's a little lymphatic vessel on either side of our neck that must take the lymph from thousands of lymph vessels. So when we get tight in our neck and shoulders and most people are walking around like this, we need to relax those shoulders. So I'm going to show you how. And by opening up our and relaxing our shoulders, we're opening up our lymphatic vessels, which are right here. Now, how we're going to start is with the lymph man shuffle. Now, I'm lymph man, if you don't happen to know that. Uh, but we're going to start with the lymph man shuffle. And many people move their shoulders, but they move it up and down. They move it backwards, forwards. I'm going to show you how to alternate your shoulders, which really opens up the major lymph drain here. So the, the lymph man shuffle starts by picking up your left shoulder, and the other one goes down. And we alternate it. One up, one down. And we do that 10 times. Oh, that feels good already. <sighs> already I'm breathing easier. When this is blocked up, our body is not getting complete circulation, and we become slightly acidic. Ah, that does feel better. So now that you know how to open up the shoulders, and you can do that anywhere, in the car, in standing in line, in an elevator, at your desk, you can open up your shoulders by just doing this about 10 times. Now the most important place for us to drain is by the major lymph vessels. So what you're going to do is put your fingers right, well this is what I do, I put my fingers right by and what we're teaching in the course you put your fingers right on your trapezius, right at the base of your trapezius. The trapezius is the muscle in the back of the shoulders. Put your fingertips, cross your arms, put your fingertips right against the trapezius. And your, this part of your hand is going to go over the clavicle bones in the front. And what we're going to do is there's a soft spot between the trapezius and the clavicles. That soft spot which sometimes is kind of puffy and swelled up in some people showing to have a lymphatic problem, we're just going to gently pump down. Pump and release. Pump and release. Pump and release. And you could do this five or ten times. I'm just going to do it ten times. Just a nice, gentle aim towards your heart. You're pumping under the bone, aiming towards the heart. Just a nice, gentle pump. So we're opening up the major lymph drain. So today we learned about opening up the shoulders so that our lymph can flow better by doing the lymph man shuffle. And if you have any shoulder problems, take it easy on this because we're so tight in our shoulders. When we start doing this, we get sore if we're very tight in our shoulders because acid waste has to move out. So do it five or ten times, you know, a couple of times a day at first, and then you could do it more often as needed. And this, as long as we're gentle, just pumping in the hollow spot right between the trapezius and the clavicle, 
we're not gonna hurt anything, just very gentle, about five or 10 times. Already I feel open in my jaw, my neck, my shoulders, and my chest because I've pulled fluid through the lymphatic system. If this makes sense to you that we have complete control over our lymphatic system, a system that's meant to clean us, then contact me at ossipinskihealthacademy.com. Check out our virtual classes. We have two different tracks. We have one for therapists, learning lymph practic, and lymph practic is more than body work. It's a philosophy for a healthy life. And then we can't forget about the public. The public is the one who needs to understand how to maintain your lymphatic system. Because not understanding how to maintain your lymphatic system with diet, supplements, exercise, and self-lymphatic drainage is creating many of your health problems. We're filling with cellular waste. So if you're the type of person who likes to take control of their health, this class is probably for you. But if you're a person who just wants to take some pills and go see your doctor and really don't do anything, then I'll be very honest, this class may not be for you. But if you're a person who really wants to take control of your health, I promise you're gonna learn information that's gonna change your life and you'll be able to use this information for the rest of your life. Let me know if you have any questions. Check us out at the ossipinskihealthacademy.com. Have a great day.